Hello guys, it's Mr. Wahidul Haq here, back with another video. Uh, today I'm going to be upgrading the RAM on this Toshiba, it's an old, it's an old Toshiba satellite. Uh, this is the RAM, uh, it's a 4GB Corsair 800MHz RAM. Uh, currently this only has 2 gigs of RAM in it. So I'm going to, it needs an upgrade, otherwise you can't run no stuff. I'm here today with uh, It's Unknown, he has Hello. a YouTube channel, you go check it out and subscribe to him. Hi. <laughs> Alright, let's get to this. Uh, the first thing you'll need is one of these. This tip. It's like a crisscross in the middle. It's like a cross in the middle basically. Right, so this one is quite easy to install RAM on. Because uh, it's a component. If you've not watched my other video, go check it out. It takes a long time to take it off because you have to take off all of it. First thing I recommend to do is uh, unhook the battery. Just to avoid, it's this way. To avoid electrocuting yourself. Why oh, is already unlocked? Okay. Hold on, let's just discharge. We're going to discharge it first. Make sure there's nothing left in the unit. To discharge, you just hold the power button for 30, 20 seconds. Okay, that should be enough. Okay, should be discharged. Also, I recommend using a uh, static gloves for this to avoid dis uh, breaking your units and stuff. Okay, this is off now. Let's just show you uh, inside of this. Okay, so that's a two gig RAM at the moment, and as you can see, there's another slot here just to put another stick in. Uh, there's a notch right there, so you have to line it up with this notch on the RAM so I'm going this way because the notch is there you just shove it in and then this one with one hand I don't know why okay it's in place now what you do just push down on it should click into place and that's it it's all installed that's all you have to do I'm gonna test it now let me boot up one second, this one has another extra. The, okay. There's two extra on each side for some reason. There you go. Okay. Nice and tight. Gonna put the battery back in. Is it this way? Yeah. This goes in this way first. Okay. Lock the battery in place. I'm gonna see if it gets any blue screens or death or anything. It's a pretty old laptop. Alright, I'm gonna set it up now. Okay, sorry for the background noise by the way. My washing machine is done. So far the boot up seems a bit faster. Alright, it's booting up now. It's nearly done. Alright, the laptop has loaded up now. Uh, we're going to check the uh, quickest way, which is through Task Manager. See how much uh, RAM is installed, it says. Uh, this is an old laptop, so it might take a while to load. Right. Okay, so the amount of memory that's being used has gone lower on uh, IDU, which is quite good. Uh, performance. Okay. So it can only handle 3 gigs of RAM at the moment for some reason. I think it's limited to 3 gigs of RAM. We put in uh, 6 gigs altogether, it seems to only recognize 3 gigs. I think that's only because it, it only supports 3 gigs of RAM. So I might pull out the 2 gigs, so it just runs on that one 4 gig stick. Alright, we'll just check in the settings, hold on. System. About. Okay, so it recognizes the 4 gig, but there's only 3 gig usable. Alright guys, we're going to take out that 2 gig now, and uh, this is the hard drive compartment. You can easily just pull it open after you unlock it. 
There's the hard drive there. 250 gigs. Just gonna lock this back up. Okay, now open up the RAM again. Just get a closer view for you. Ooh, let's check out the battery first because this is all locked up. Makes a big difference. Okay, so to remove the RAM, you just pull sideways removed now I don't know if this RAM is soldered onto the motherboard or not but we'll have to check just come on this one's gonna be hard to get out there you go okay so this is a Samsung 2 gig memory with a 6 cast timing this is using a 5 cast timing which could also be wise causing a problem so we'll just use one stick uh, where's the notch? Can't see the notch. It's there. There you go. I think that's it. Gonna push down on it. Yep, that's it. Right, that's it. Just gonna lock it in now. 